Have you ever wondered what would happen if a hypersonic missile is approaching an aircraft carrier? You see, aircraft carriers never operate by themselves. They are always part of a carrier strike group which are all there to make it almost impossible to strike the carrier. However, if the missile somehow manages to evade all these defense systems, at speeds of Mach 5 and above, these missiles have so much kinetic energy that they can break through the carrier's hull even without a warhead. This could cause serious damage to important systems or even sink the ship. Imagine trying to shoot down a tiny object flying at speeds over 15 times faster than the speed of sound. This practically looks impossible, but anti-ballistic missiles like the Aegis SM-3 can actually shoot down ballistic missiles before they reach their target. This process begins with the three-stage rocket booster and a kill vehicle which travels alone after the last booster separates. Using intercept data from ground bases, the kill vehicle is guided with advanced systems towards an intercept point, where it then views the target using its own onboard sensors. From there, it uses small thrusters that allows the projectile to accurately maneuver towards the target in the final phase of the engagement, where it rams itself into the incoming warhead to disable 